Take a look at these gas prices in Southern California. $6 a gallon in some places. Drivers say it's out of control. These are record setting prices, and that's part of the reason why the U.S. and its allies are releasing 60 million barrels of oil from strategic reserves. KDK Money Editor John Delano has a look at how much prices could still jump locally. The United States is the largest oil producer in the world. Russia is second, with Saudi Arabia a close third. Despite Russia's brutal attack on Ukraine, however, nobody has yet placed sanctions on Russian oil. But worries about supply from Russia have jacked up the price of oil to over $100 a barrel, and the price at the pump is going up too. It's entirely possible, John, that we're going to see gasoline uh, hit prices in Pennsylvania that we haven't ever seen. AAA's Jim Garrity says gasoline prices locally could hit $4.20 a gallon, a record, which is why President Biden had these words in his State of the Union address on Tuesday. I can announce the United States has worked with 30 other countries to release 60 million barrels of oil from reserves around the world. These steps will help blunt gas prices here at home. But I know news about what's happening can seem alarming to all Americans. But I want you to know we're going to be OK. 60 million barrels, half from U.S. reserves, may sound like a lot. But University of Pittsburgh energy economist Jeremy Weber notes. The release that's been announced amounts to, if it were spread over a month, uh, about 2 percent of global oil consumption. So that's that's not a, t a lot, um, but it's it's something. Is it enough to affect gasoline prices in this region or in the U.S.? Not really, says Patrick Dahan, head of petroleum analysis for Gas Buddy. It should have been a larger release, given the context, given the war, given the fact that Russia is the second largest oil producer globally. Um, but as we're seeing the response, uh, as you mentioned, oil prices are surging at one point reaching $110 a barrel on this, uh, again, kind of disappointing announcement in terms of how small the release is. Of course, some experts tell me you cannot always assess the effectiveness of a release of oil immediately after the announcement. It may take some weeks.